first three people who will go to the hellfire. The Quran said this is the scariest hadith ever. Allah will bring a man that memorized the Quran. And he would ask him, why did you memorize the Quran? Ya Allah, I memorized the Quran so I can spread your deen. So I can teach the people how to read the Quran. Kathabt, you're lying. You did it so they can call you Qari. And you go around and you refuse to recite until you are paid. Take him to the hellfire. Hafiz of Kitab Allah is the first person who will enter the hellfire because of the lack of sincerity. Bring the second guy. He's a huge, like we call now, big, huge donor. I gave you so much money that you do not need anyone. Allah is telling him. So what did you do with it? Ya Allah, I spend it on building masajid, building Islamic schools, digging wells, orphans, widows. Kathabt. You're lying. You did it so they can call you Jawad, Kareem, generous man. And they did. Take him to the hellfire. And listen to the third one. At least these people maybe enjoyed the, the fame. The third one, Shaheed. Shaheed. So he did not have a chance to enjoy the fame. Why did you die? Why did you fight? Ya Allah, to make the Islam the dominant, to make Kalimatullah hiya al-Uliya, la ilaha illallah, kathabt. To me and you, Allahu Akbar, mujahid. Kathabt, you're lying. You did it so they can call you shaheed. And they did take him to the hellfire. The opposite of sincerity is showing off. And Rasulullah warned us so many hadith about showing off. One of the scariest ayat in the Quran. And Allah Azza wa said, and we came to everything they have done and we made it into scattered dust. It's not about the quantity. Ibn al-Mubarak, rahimahullah, he said, there are so many deeds that are small, but they become giant because of the ikhlas. And so many deeds that are giant, but they become nothing because of riyah. Giant! Imagine, he came, five million dollars donation, but inside, it's just literally, just to show off. So it doesn't matter five million, seven billion, doesn't matter. The quantity doesn't mean anything. The other guy came with five dollars from the bottom of his heart. That's his allowance for two weeks. But he was really wanted to help from the bottom of their heart. Anyone that me and you are trying to please is going to die. And the reward is going to die with them. So let's please al hayy la yamut. Let's please the one that does not die. And that is only one. Allah Azza wa Jal.